No sahamahan tuon ta. We just gotta keep on pushing the boundaries to see if there is a limit. Tanel Riittinen, who has autistic twins, has invited us to help them. Dad Simo spends too much time with his work, and the family feels like they don't have a man in the house. We have only two days to fix their problems, and we're going to do it the Dutchen style. got back to Finland after Dutchens in America we wanted to do something completely different something with heart and balls in it and we came up with a great show called Dutchens Home Invasion it's a show where we move in with an ordinary Finnish family for two days they're real people living their real life they're real families and kids and they have a problem that we try to fix <laughs> we're no Dr. Phil's but we bring in a bunch of positive anarchy yeah it's uh, shock therapy yeah, you could call that shock therapy. It's not as much a stunt show as our previous uh, things we've done, but it still has the same Dutchens attitude in it. People have seen that crazy side of us. They've seen that for 10 years. Now it's great to show the other side of us as well, the emotional side, who we also are. Now you're gonna see one episode of the Dutchens Home Invasion. Yeah, because the family is Finnish, we're speaking Finnish and English in it. Take a look what the show is all about. about two million sheep and we just saw two wolves harassing them we gotta catch the wolves with the help of the family come on there's wolves eating your sheep we need to catch them <laughs> Escape. Look at it run. <laughs> he won't bother us again. He's too afraid. Huomenta vaan. Riittiset. Terve. Joo, ehtoita vaan. Simo. Tai se susikin siinä <laughs> That was a bit of a shocking start for the morning, but hey, that's what we're here to do. To shake him up a little bit and to make sure that the father takes a role raising the boys. Mitä äiti odottaa tältä meidän vierailulta? Isä ja pojat niin oppis touhuamaan sellaisia miesten juttuja tuolla. Tää isä ei ota hirveesti osaa, hän on poikien harrastamisen. Joo, täytyy myöntää, että tota, aika, aika vähästähän se on ollut. Että. Next we'll learn how to separate rams from the herd. The mother Kaisa does all the work with their two billion sheep. And we want to find out how the job is done. Now we're gonna do the man's job. Us and the boys, Timo and Tarmo, we're gonna help Kaisa with the sheep. Because we know sheep. <laughs> Just tell us what to do and we'll do it. Siellä on pässejä seassa. Niillä on merkit korvissa, että kuka kukin on. Tarvitaan lista nyt niistä. Ja mitä olette kattonut ja erotellut, merkkaatte sitten väreillä. Mistä me tunnistetaan ne? No sieltä häntä päästä vähän alhaalta koittaa, että mitä siellä olisi päässille. Joo, joo, mä katson niitä silmiin, kyllä ne sitten ne miehet näkee tuolta. Joo. Se on merkattu. Check. Ensimmäinen. Joo, menitkö tää nyt? Pässi, mikä pässi, minkä se teidän luonnolle mahtaa? Nyt taitaa taas mennä pojilla peneilyksi. Eikö tää on meillä, me hoidetaan tää. Let's get it done. Look, four sheep separate already. Oh, son, not anymore. Hey, this one's got balls. Let's close the gate. Let's paint the dudes red. You write down the number and I'll do the mark. Got it. Look! 
I have to give it to Dharma and Dima for their creativity. They paint them off. It, it looks nice, but how do we explain this to the mother? But weren't we supposed to mark all of them? Every single shit? No, just the boys. Dimo and Tarmo, they got so out of control. They're so energetic, so active. They're painting everything, not just the sheep, but each other, us, and fences and everything. And that's how they are. Here's a cartoon that Tarmo drew. He's the Tarmo man, that's his superhero character. And right here, he's battling against Lava King. They're autistic, and it's kind of hard to understand what they're saying. But the way they express themselves is through drawing cartoons. And they have an amazing imagination. Look at that, that's the Lava King. He says, I kill you. Of course, Tarmo man beats Lava King and kills it and saves the whole world. And right here, peace comes back to the earth. He likes superhero stuff. Hey, pojat, me muuten tarvitaan supersankarin nimet mekin. Ja siinä nimi on Bobo. Oh, boss! So yes, boss! Mikäs mä oon? Kasva, kajau, man. Hairy armpit man. I'm the boss. Yeah. We're off to fight against the evil world to save the souls of innocent women. Tarbo man. Super Demo Galaxy 2. The boss. And hairy armpit man. Together they are the fanatic four. And they fight the boredom of everyday lives. Now, their mission is to show the father how much there is to do with the boys. Welcome to Superhero Flight Simulator 3004! All right, Seamus gonna climb into the cockpit of the digger and start the flying simulator. Oh, 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 oh kyllä, kyllä. Oh. Joo. Uskallatteko te lähtette? Kyllä, mä All right, let's see if he's ready to fly. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Super Demo! Yeah! 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 Laskeutuminen suoraan jaloille. Mahtavasti I don't think Simo has realized how wonderful kids he has. So there's just so many fun, great things that he could do with the boys. And so far he hasn't been doing that. He's been away a lot. We want to make Simo into a man and the dad for the boys. Father Kaiser told us that the real problem is the dad, Simo's kindness. He doesn't say no to any job offer, and that's why he's away from home too much. And now we're gonna test if he's gonna say no to anything. All right, Simo, here we come. We're gonna put you through a real test. Howdy. Saatu tällä syödä sohvalla. Nice, I was pretty hungry already. Okay. <laughs> uh, take this. All right. Ah, damn it. How did I do that? Saako ottaa vaatteet? Kato. Saako riisu? No, ota minun puolesta. Saako istua syli? No, samaahan tuonita. All right. I also got to take my clothes off. He generally is such a laid-back guy that he doesn't say no to anything. And he's just like, oh, that's fine. Yeah, well, you can sit on my lap. All the time we were just like, when does Simo stand up and says, okay, enough's enough. We just gotta keep on pushing the boundaries to see if there is a limit. Should we go and clean the sofa? Milan no lahtis no like. Hei, se painepesuri olis hyvä. Hyvä, sillähän mä aina kaiken pysyn. 
pensalla hinkkaas, koska sillä on lähtee maalikki. Niin Kyllä, lähtis käsistä maalit samalla. Kai sitä jostain löytyy. Miks? En mä tiedä, voi se kyllä pikkasen haiskahtaa tuolla sitten. I think we should burn it. Saako ton polttaa? Eiköhän se joua. Yeah, I don't think anybody would mind. <laughs> we just couldn't find his limits, so the only thing we could do is just to go further. Poltetaanko tuolla auto nyt tuosta alta samalla pois? No vähän siltä näyttää. Haittaako se? Eipähän se käy. I was like 98% sure that's gonna be the limit. And because he didn't say no, of course we had to go through with it. Yksi, kaksi, kolme ja... Oho! Mitä siellä nyt tapahtuu? Mikä tuosta palaa tuossa hedes? Sohva. Näin tässä nyt kävi. We've tested Simo enough. I don't think he's a man enough to say no to anything. Kää mä ensin koetin vähän sitä painepesurista puhua, että jos sillä sitä olisi pessu, mutta eihän sitä sohvaa, niin tois pitänyt tuossa auton vieressä ruveta polttamaan. We're gonna stay here overnight and tomorrow we're gonna train him to be the man and the father to the boys. Hyvää yötä. Hyvää yötä, Timo. Good night, guys. Päivän aikana tiettyjä havaintoja. Talosta puuttuu isäntä. Senpä takia, kun tämä päivä on ohi, äiti Kaisa tulee tapaamaan uudistuneen päättäväisen Simon. Ja homma hoituu sillä lailla, että Simo pääsee viettämään mahtavaa touhukasta päivää Tarmo ja Timon kanssa. Ei saa ole sellaisia susi, ottakaa susi kiinni miehet, miehet perään! All the men, catch the wall! Catch the wall! After him! It's in the forest. Susi juoksi tonne vettään tonne aittan taakse. Imitoidaan tosta saaliseläintä. Tehdään susi kuoppa. Semmonen naamioitu juttu, mihin susi putoaa. Yeah, this is starting to work. I mean, Simo is ready to play with us and the boys. The boys are excited. They're loving it. Because it's something that they haven't done with the dad for a long, long time, so... Missä a susi on? Missä Naamiointia kato, ettei Susi näe meitä. Niin. Noin. Hyvä. The boys are making sheep noises. They trap the wolf this way into the pitfall. And Simo's job 
Just to catch it. I thought Simo played his role really well and boys are starting to see him in a new way. But the day is not over yet, so we still got one more thing to do. Now we have the final test for the Simo and the boys. They gotta drive that special made truck over the car wrecks and crash through the burning stacks of hay. It's actually pretty exciting. The car wrecks and the flaming hay. But let them practice first, just on the plain field. Eiköhän me siitä selvitä. Sä oot ihan varma tästä. Kyllä. Upeeta. Look at them go. He's actually putting pedal to the metal. I bet the boys are nervous. Yeah, after the test drive, Timo was so afraid, he was just shaking. And at first, Dad, Simo, was trying to convince him to do the stunt, but uh, then he made the right decision just to do the stunt with the other boy, Tarmo. Simo really took the responsibility over his boys, letting Timo out. That was where he really showed that he is a dad. And I thought that way he also gained some trust from the boys. We think that Simo and the boys and the whole family did so good that we wanted to surprise them. We have organized them a traditional Finnish barn dance. And in here in this barn, there is friends of the family and a band waiting for them. Yeah, this is our gift to them for the good job. Simo said that he hasn't been dancing ever since his wedding walls, like 15 years ago. And he made a promise never to dance again. This is probably going to be the biggest challenge for him. Saanko luo? Mitäs? 
<laughs> en tiedä yhtään, mutta tanssitaan jotakin. <laughs> Kaisu was so proud of his husband. Today he proved us that he's the real man of the house. Oli niin kaunista. Viimeis tanssit vähän ei säänyt täällä yhdessä, niin... Haluttais ottaa teille malia. Everybody was so touched. Simo bonding with the boys and finding his role as a father for the boys. That probably touched him so much that he got tears in his eyes. Tuleeko meidän kuulut sanoa, että hirveä ikä? Tulee. Kyllä meillä ainakin tulee teitä hirveä ikä. What touched me the most is the how brave they were, how brave the mother is with the autistic twins. Thank God we had the honor of just witnessing what happened there today. What just happened It was truly amazing seeing the whole family coming together and they became whole, so to speak. Thank you, Reitisen, from the bottom of my heart. In the next episode, we will take part in the Gumball 3000 rally and drive from New York to Los Angeles for a distance of 3000 miles. The main award, the Spirit of the Gumball, is awarded for the best overall attitude. And we're in it to show the contestants what the real Spirit of the Gumball is all about. Taisi katsoa siltä, että auto ei liiku tästä enää mihinkään ja meikäläinen menee putkaan. 